The following episode contains strong language, cool nicknames and fishing. The Tiwi Islands are an important part of the top end wedding story. So I told Steve when he goes out to Tiwi Island, bring back gold. Tomorrow we're going to embark on a locations mission to the Tiwi Islands. Mm -hmm. I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to get in a bit of fishing. Mm, sounds good. Haven't heard a word I've said, have you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a head on you like a warp sand shoe. I'm gonna have a look at you. The old man's a prick. Cool, on it. On what? What? On another fucking planet is what? The Tiwi Islands are this amazing remote paradise about 80 k's north of Darwin. Hey, you got any signal? Hey, I got a couple of bars. Yeah? Nada. Damn you, Vodafone. Oh, looks like you might have to live in the present for once. Oh, dear. Come on. Back in my day, this is our Google Maps right here. You look like a pirate. We're looking for beach and according to this map, it's just over... There. And there, and there, and there. We're on an island. Well, thank you, smartass. I'm looking for a particular point between the heads. Can you make yourself useful and go over and talk to the locals or something? The locals on TV are super friendly. They all have really awesome nicknames like X-Man, Boy George, RuPaul, Daffy Duck, and Rhonda. I've always wanted a nickname. Grumpy, maybe? <laughs> Grumpy? Grumpy. What about Leatherman? Always carry a Leatherman, always. Struggle bucket? Maybe not struggle bucket. Can I borrow your phone for five minutes just to log in and out of Instagram? Therein's the reason. If I had kids, I would never let them on that social media. They'd hate you. No, oh, no, I'd balance it all out. I'd let them drink piss and have parties at home and shit. I didn't know you wanted kids. Well, I don't really. I just, just always thought I'd be a good uncle, you know? just never had any brothers or sisters. I'll trade you my sister for some phone time. You're an addict. It was time to clear Morgan's head and help her connect with nature. Come on, I'm fanging for a beer. Let's grab a cart and a piss and do some fishing. Oh, there's no drinking here. This is a dry community. What? Yeah, yeah g'day, Wayne. Yeah, uh, Mate, I just don't think Tiwi's gonna cut it. Yeah, yeah, she is. Hey, Uncle Wayne. This is exactly what you want, and the access is so easy. There's a ferry from Darwin. Fuck me. I can't believe she'd go and stitch me up like that. You're a complete ingrate, you know that? I'm not gonna let you blow a completely perfect location just because you can't go without a drink for a couple of days. Oh, come on. Like, this means something to you. This is just another thing that's been handed to you on a silver platter. Yeah, well, maybe I'm good at it. I'll be the judge of that. Hang on a second. Jury's in. Ba bong your shit house. Sorry, you know. you know, your dad's a producer and Wayne Blair's your uncle. Don't worry, he's not my actual uncle. It's just a black fella thing. He's just an older guy that I trust and respect. Mm. Sort of like I'd be your uncle. What's that? What? I think I just saw a fish jump. Get the rods, mate, go! Fishing is the single greatest thing a man can do. Pretty boring, eh? Ah, oh, I'm over it. How about you, Morgs? I want again, I want again! <laughs> well, I always thought I loved fishing. Maybe I just love the drinking bit. Well, it turns out I'm a natural fisher person, which Steve didn't take so well, so to make him feel better about being a nicknameless old grump, I took him shopping. Nice legs. Really? I always thought they were a bit hairy. Hairy is good. Sisters like hairy. It's like a bear. Yeah. Well, a bear. I uh, even finally got my nickname. The bear. Manly. Strong. I don't know if you should be called the bear, though. Why not? Because bears can catch fish. <laughs> <laughs>